Hi, my name is Julianne Devlin. I'm a primary school teacher and I teach in the northern part of the country in Malhe in County Donegal. I'm the author of Tip of the Tongue, which is an oral language and vocabulary development resource. It's basically a box that contains a wealth of inspiring resources that can be used by pupils and the teachers alike. Hands on, ready to use. It was published last year and it fits in with the new language curriculum. Um, so basically, you've got three boxes. So you've got the junior box, which is for junior infants, it's for our second class. It's pretty much um, picture based. So it's good for the readers and the non readers. It's great for those who are EEL students for resource teaching and so on. Then the middle box for second class to fourth class, and then the senior box for fourth to sixth. They overlap, but it's perfect for the teaching of single classes, or if you're multi-grade like myself, I've said in third and fourth, um, then you've enough material to last you um, for a few years, three, three years or four years, depending on the, the size and amount of classes you have in your room. So basically, um, I'm just reading here from the flyer, but you can get more information from the Clever Kids website of what's uh, in each box, okay? So basically in the boxes you've um, got debate cards, story starters, three word cards, countdown card, dice, various barrier games, um, question cards, scenarios like your interviews and uh, telephone conversations, object cards, idiom cards, photographs, tongue twisters, grammar cards, talk cards, cooperative learning role cards and many more. Then you've got the areas of vocabulary, they're covered by hundreds of um, theme-based vocabulary cards and their words of the day and there's a vocabulary story sheet too that's there to reinforce your new words of the day and um, to get them ingrained in that long-term memory. You also have um, Hanuman, Cinnamon's Antman cards, you've got affixes which is like your suffixes and your um, prefixes as well each manual gives um, a yearly plan of um, what you can teach on a month by month basis, basis sorry, um, covering areas of your overused words, your emotions words like happy and sad words and physical appearances and characteristics so a large bank of vocabulary being developed there. Um, so why I did this, I didn't set out to create a resource, um, it's just the same as any teacher, you've got your little bits and pieces sitting in cupboards and um, I have to uh, give my husband the credit because he's seen me slaving over a laminator and, and cutting all these different cards for my own use for my classroom and he suggested putting them in boxes, and put the boxes in a large box and um, it's just, I knew it was working in my classroom, I knew the, the pupils' vocabulary were expanding because I had them for three years and so I had permission from the, from the principal then to do likewise for his room and make another resource for the junior room and just of the tongue was born it was piloted and um, then it was it was published because um, I was encouraged it was encouraged that it was a good resource and I'm delighted that it fits in with the new language curriculum um, so my aim now is to create little videos short videos two three minutes long because I know it's very time consuming for teachers who are using this resource to have to um, make their way through a teacher manual so the resources and um, the little videos sorry hopefully will get you started on the different modules and the first module the next video I'm going to cover tongue twisters to show you that these little fun snippets of language can be quite educational as well being fun and I'll show you how you connect them into the new language curriculum thank you for watching